Now, this is how you can find the pointer control in iPhone running the latest iOS, which is iOS 18 right now, but let's get started. So the pointer control is a settings menu, which allows you to tweak the cursor or pointer when you connect the mouse or trackpad to your iPhone. However, it doesn't work or it doesn't show up unless you already have the accessory connected. So this is like a prerequisite in order to make that work or make the settings menu show up. So at first, go to the Bluetooth section, figure out the connection like I have here, the like a Bluetooth mouse of a third party. So I have to enable it on the mouse, set up it, set, set it up like, you know, in the in the connections department. So make sure it is connected and then I can move over to the accessibility section and I'm able to find the... Uh, the pointer control menu right there so it is right here in the accessories and i can tap on it and customize it as much as i like you should also keep in mind that the assistive touch has to be enabled for this to work because if you don't have the assistive touch enabled this menu doesn't even show up as well and also the mouse cannot even be used so this is another condition to be met when you want to use a mouse or a trackpad to control the iPhone, right? So this is kind of important. Uh, to be honest, the assistive touch button kind of stands in a way and I don't like it that much, but it has to be turned on for me to use a mouse. So yeah, that's kind of a thing to keep in mind. But what you can do is to lower it down at the idle opacity. You can lower it down to as much as 15%, which makes it barely visible and that makes the whole thing like much more usable. So let me know below in the comments if this is the thing that you are going after or if it's something that you had in mind. Go ahead and subscribe for more tutorials and videos like this one and I'll catch you later.